I'm back. I apologise, I haven't done a, a video for a little while, but I've not been too well. Um, but some recent doctor's appointments have hopefully sorted me out and I'm getting there. So, hello! Right. Um, I'll just say before I read Charlie's book, he has had a lovely day at school today and I'm quite surprised. Um, last night Charlie was still awake after gone midnight, gone like half twelve. So I'm not too sure what time he eventually went to sleep. But Poppy had woke up crying because she'd give herself cramp. <laughs> um, <clears throat> and Charlie bought his covers and was sat by his baby gate, like trying to find out what was happening to her. Like he wouldn't get back into bed till she was calm and he knew that she was okay. Um, so I don't know how the kids got that much energy. I wish I could go to bed at that hour and still like be <laughs> full of bounce the next day. But it says, um, Charlie's had a good morning and engaged with tearing and sticking green paper. Music therapy and PA. He really liked running in the hall and balancing on the beams. That's really good. Like I'm glad he's been running because obviously he's high mobility and stuff. Like he has days where he's better and he can do a bit of a run or a bit of a jog. But then he has days when like he maybe goes a few steps and then will sit just sit down wherever he is, he'll just sit down and like give himself a minute. Um so he got he has some days that are pretty bad with it. But the main thing is that Chai is learning like how to manage it now. Whereas before he would just try walking still, even though he's screaming because he was in pain. Um but he won't stop because he was like, I don't want it. Why you know, why should I stop? I'm just going to keep going. But it's good now that he realises he has to go and rest. And that doesn't mean he has to end what he's doing. It means he just needs to take a minute to, you know, let his joints settle back down, if you like. And balancing on the beams, because of his home mobility, he's a bit wobbly on his feet, bless him. Um, and can be a bit, like, clumsy and stuff. So the fact that he's been balancing on beams is, like, really wicked. It said, Chai didn't eat much lunch, beef dinner, had a couple of potatoes, one Yorkshire pudding and a couple of bits of beef. That is probably just due to the fact that there was um, Yorkshire puddings on the plate. Charlie's like Yorkshire pudding, like crazy. And if there's, if you like, if you have some on the table, and you say, right, Charlie, you've got to eat some dinner, and then you can have a Yorkshire pudding, he just won't eat anything until he has his Yorkshire pudding. If you put it on the plate, then he's just interested in that, so he doesn't care. About, he doesn't care about anything else, which is like it's really funny because he's such a good eater, like big meals and stuff. Um, with meat and fish, he'll eat pretty much anything. He just won't eat sandwiches or anything like that. He, he's just a cooked dinner boy through and through. <laughs> and it says, Charlie's bottom was a bit red looking today. But it didn't bother him. It was just like, mostly, you know, just making us aware. But then he gets eczema, so he gets that, like, in his nappy area quite often. Um, and it says, he's had a lovely afternoon with the biker belay, and Charlie loved being outside. The biker belay is probably, like, my one of my favourite things they're doing at school at the minute. Um, it means Charlie can learn how to ride a bike, or he can sit on one of the chairs and have a bike ride with somebody, you know, with one with one of the adults that come along to do it with them. Because obviously he's hyper mobile. Like he started having a little bit of a go on his ride along car. Like he can get like a few, if you imagine like the equivalent of like a few steps forward. But he doesn't go forward; he goes backwards, and then he can go like one forwards, and then he just carry on going backwards. <laughs> but he can do it. He's got the motion, which is the main thing. So obviously anything like a bike is like. That's like a big deal. Um, for him to be able to do that is like very, very difficult because he, he it's like his feet are like jelly, so they can't like kind of you can't like put too much pressure on them to be able to you know make the wheels turn if you like. So the fact that there's these special bikes and some of them are more like trikes, so it'll be easier for Charlie to slow to the ground, so he's not having to live with like his legs is high and things like that. So that's really awesome that he still gets to do things like that despite his disability. And then there's been pictures of him when it, it looks like there's a chair on front of the top wheel of a bike. And then there's someone just zooming around. And because Charlie loves to go fast, like he, he just loves fast. Um, he just loves it. He just thinks it's great. He loves it, like feeling the wind like blowing in his hair, even though he's not got much of it now. <laughs> um, but he just loves that, like the, just the feel of like wind on his skin. So I can imagine him just being a little giggle bum. So I'm, just, I'm so relieved, really, that he's had such a good day. Because I, I thought, oh, Thursdays is one of his favourite days at school, with him having his music therapist, Angela, like when he gets to see her every week, he just loves her, he absolutely adores her, and it doesn't matter what mood he is in, if I say to him, you get to see Angela today, he's just like, turns into a hyper crazy man, and then he's just really happy, and I thought, it would be such a shame if he goes to school and he's so tired that he doesn't enjoy it, because it's like his favourite part of the week, but that's all good. 
So, um, I just want to say thank you to everyone as well for your ongoing support. It's like really good. So hopefully next on our list of things to do is try and get in with something to do with TV um, to obviously reach like a, a bigger amount of people and really get like lift it off the ground more so. And if you haven't already, we have paired up with Friends with Morgan. So we've got Susie and Morgan and his sister on there and Rowan and Autistic Genius. So we've got Tom and Jules. And then there's us, and we've made like a kind of collaboration page, um, which we're going to be doing like some new stuff on. So all our existing pages, like Year in Life of Autism, uh, obviously Autistic Genius and Friends with Morgan, all them separate pages are still going to be up and running. We're just all coming together for this particular page to make something new, which is AC, um, Autism Central, which the link is, I think, Dean's shared it on, onto, our, onto our page. So if you want to give it a check out, that's wicked. If you have any ideas or there's anything you'd like to ask or want to bring something new, then please do feel free to share. You know, if there's anything we can do to help, we'll try our hardest. So I hope you're all having a great week and that it's nice and sunny where you are because finally we've got a bit of sunshine today. So take care guys and I'll speak to you soon.